and welcome back to Open Rocks. I'm Craig. I'm here in the Lapidary Shop today. We're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be having a North, aka Lake Superior, versus the South, aka Lake Michigan, rock battle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick out five rocks from each location out of my personal collection. We are going to bring them over. We are going to cut them on the four to five inch lapidary saw. And then at the end of the video, we are going to have you, the viewer, Leave a comment and let us know who you think was the clear winner of the battle. All right, well, let's get after it. Okay, here are the two bins that we're going to be choosing from. The one on the left here is Lake Michigan. This is going to be the south. And the one here on the right is Lake Superior. That is going to be the north. So I'm going to be selecting five rocks from each bin here. Now the only rule is that it has to be a 2 inch maximum diameter because I am going to be using my 4 to 5 inch trim saw to cut these open. Alright, well, I'm going to get to picking here and I will show you exactly what I pick out. Okay, so first up, these are going to be the ones that we're cutting from Lake Michigan, the south. And next up here, these are going to be the ones that we are cutting from Lake Superior in the north. Alright, well, let's see who wins the battle. Let's head over to the saw and get cutting. All right, now the moment of truth. Round one. Here is the South, Lake Michigan. Ooh, looks like we got a really pretty Jasper here. Oh, that's going to be tough to beat. Round one for Lake Superior. Ooh, looks like we got another form of Jasper. Jasper versus Jasper. Ooh, look at the swirly patterns on that one. Ooh, that's a tough call. All right, round two. Lake Michigan. Oh, wow. Look at that. Banded shirt. Beautiful. Let's see what we got going on from Lake Superior. Looks like we got a piece of porphyry. Ooh, those are some beautiful, beautiful feldspar crystals. A little tiny bit of epidote in there, too. All right, tough round two as well. All right, round three for the south, Lake Michigan. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Not exactly sure what this is. Maybe a form of rhyolite? Interesting. Uh, that's an interesting one. All right, let's see what the uh, north has to offer here. And for Lake Superior, ooh, that is really pretty. That's different. Ooh, another tough round. All right, round four for the south. Oh, yeah, it's all right. Little Favocytes fossil. There's Lake Michigan. Let's see what we got going on for the north up there in Lake Superior. And... Oh, that is pretty cool. Little piece of Thompsonite and host. All right, and now for the final round. All right, well, I just made a complete mess of my workbench. All right, for the final round, we're going to let the north go first, and here we go for our Lake Superior Rock. Ooh, that's pretty. We've got some basalt, some pre night. Not bad. Let's see what we got going on for Lake Michigan on the south. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful Jasper. Wow. Okay. I might be a little biased because I'm from Wisconsin and, you know, I like uh, rock hunting Lake Michigan, but. You be the judge. Well, that concludes our little rock battle between the North and the South. 
So I'm going to leave it up to you. Drop a comment. Let me know who you think the clear winner is. I'm a little biased, so I'm not going to vote. But we will see you again next week. Have a great one.